So right now I'm in the Maldives in the middle of the Indian Ocean on this very bumpy boat and I'm gonna try scuba diving for the first time ever. All right, it's a sunny morning. I'm still in Mafushi in Maldives and today I'm gonna try to go scuba diving for the first time in my life. So this should be something completely new for me. Pretty excited. So I'm doing my diving with this place called Eco Dive Club. They seem like a very professional place. I talked to them yesterday and signed some papers. Cool thing about them is that they also seem to be a very eco-friendly place, as the name suggests. But I'm not getting my paddy license or like open water certification because that takes four days. So I'm just doing this like two hour course or thingy called Discover Scuba Diving where I'll be assisted the whole time and someone's just gonna take me into the water deeper than I've ever gone before in my life. So first they gave us some basic safety training to be safe and then they showed us how to equalize our air pressure because you know that's an issue when you go underwater. And then they asked me to uh, wear a wetsuit and at first I was like, why? Because it's not really that cold in the water there. And then they were like, you know, it's gonna look cool and I was like, okay, I'm wearing it. Which one was it? I'm headed to the port to actually get on a ship to go into the water. I'm wearing like my outfit halfway in. Captain of the ship. We're on the boat and we're about to head out. That is tight. Okay. Okay, ready? Okay. like swinging over because this boat is swinging wild left and right it's because I'm holding on to the railing uh, getting down with this camera is gonna be tricky but that was such a cool experience that whole thing was so freaking cool you know I think I was under the water for 45 minutes at first I was basically like on the surface and it looked kind of murky the water the visibility wasn't that great and I thought it was gonna be like that the whole time I was just gonna you know practice uh, moving my feet and all that but no once we went a little bit lower and I had to like equalize it, just the pressure in my ears and all. Things got really clear and really, really pretty. 
Maldives is supposed to be one of the best places on earth for uh, scuba diving and I can see why. So insanely pretty, like massive restructures, lots of fish. I think I saw an eel, but lots of small fish, lots of big pretty fish. <laughs> Just so much cool stuff. I definitely want to get certified and do this more on my own. The only interesting thing I didn't expect was that my mouth was getting dry, but I think maybe I was doing something wrong, but I felt like it was getting dry because I was like constantly, you know, like, breathing in and out of my mouth and I wasn't like swallowing my own spit. But that was so freaking cool. That was so freaking cool. I'm gonna try to get off the top of the boat now because it's getting like extra extra bumpy right now. Alright, that is gonna be it for today's video. That was a lot of fun and I think that was largely because of people that I went with are so freaking professional. I know like other dive centers here take people out just for money even when the weather is bad and at first I didn't really appreciate how important it is for the wind to not be bad but tonight even on the way back when it was a bit windy I could tell like okay you should definitely not go out there when it's windy at all but yeah these people were super helpful super down to earth the guy who's running it was like really sweet and I would very very strongly recommend this place if you're ever coming to Mafushi to go diving. If you want to see more videos like this, feel free to follow my Facebook page or subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want real-time travel updates, feel free to follow me on Instagram. I'll catch you guys in the next video from uh, somewhere in Maldives.